Jacob Edwards Library. This is our public library in Southbridge. Come on inside. So to enter the children's library, you'll come right in downstairs and it's right around the corner here. Come on in. Welcome to the library. Hi, how are you? Hi, Miss Liz. Can you help me find some picture books Absolutely. today? Absolutely, come with me. So, Miss Liz, the library is open now for kids, right? Can they come in? Yes, the library's open. Come on in. We're open every day from 9 to 5. And this summer, we will be doing a Monday night program for summer fun out on our lawn from 6.30 to 7.30 every Monday night starting late June. Oh, that sounds exciting. Can you tell us about other current events that are happening at the library this summer? Absolutely. Every Wednesday and Thursday morning at 10.30, there's a story time with Miss Liz. And on Wednesdays, we'll also be doing a craft with the story. We're starting up Lego Club on Tuesday and Thursday afternoons at 3.30 to 4.30. So come on down and make some creations. We're also going to be doing a tinkering club, which is like um, a STEM night. We will do kind of projects and fun. We have like little robots. We have hex bugs. We have all kinds of fun things that we're going to play with and explore. And that's going to be on Monday mornings. That sounds like a lot of fun. So not just books, Legos and playing and a lot of fun at the right, library. Right. What are some of the other resources that are available through the library? So we have DVDs, we have music CDs, we have all computers that you can use and just play some learning games or just fun games. I have an iPad that you can use in the library when you're here. We have two museum passes currently. We have the Magic Wings Butterfly Conservatory and we also have the Park Pass for all the parks and beaches in Massachusetts that you can go to. It's the DCR Park Pass. I have used both of those with my own kids. We love exploring the parks all around it's Massachusetts. So much fun. And that pays for the parking, the pass. Everything. Awesome. Yes. And the Butterfly Conservatory. I've done that yes. as well. Great fun. <laughs> and I do have some questions from some of our students at Eastford Road School. Ooh. And some of our friends are wondering if you have some good books here. Oh, have we? Do we have good books? And we have some friends like kitties and dinosaurs. And we have our famous friend, Pete the Cat, the cat in the hat. We have the whole entire Magic Treehouse series, including Merlin's Mysteries. We have some Berenstain Bears, my favorite, Pig the Pug. We have his whole series and many, many more. We have lots of nonfiction titles for those of you who are interested in turtles or bears or zebras or cheetahs. Or, and you're wondering, what are the, these are my friends. What are these animals doing here? Well, it's because that's our theme this summer, Tales and Tales. So we will be talking about tales and tales, animal tales and fairy tales. So every week we will have a fun-filled week based on a theme, starting with a jungle week. One week we'll have a fairy tale week. One week we're going to have a dinosaur week. So every week we'll have a craft and some fun game to go with the theme of the week during the six weeks of summer reading. So my friends, you want to come on down, bring your library card with you, and come see all the cool things happening at the Jacob Edwards Library this summer. And just a note on the library cards, you can fill out the application at school. And if you already have a library card at home and you're not sure if it's still okay or you have a question or there's some, some issues, do not worry. Please come see Miss Liz and anyone on the staff and we will help you make your library card useful for you this summer to be able to borrow 
endless supply of books and everything else. We offer our show. Miss Liz, there's so many fun things happening at the library, but I do need the bathroom. Can you t point me in the right direction? Oh, uh, we have two bathrooms right here in the children's room, separate from the rest of the building for all the kids and families to use. And there they are. Thank you. Okay. Also wanted to mention that all the programs that I've been talking about, the magicians, the wizards, everybody that's coming to the library, we have Oscar the Wonder Dog, all of our programs are free and there's no charge and they're free and open to the public and again most of our programming are on monday nights at 6 30 to 7 30 out on our lawn um, we also have some um, very um, interesting bands and music called crocodile river and we have dan the lego man he's a master lego builder he's going to be here at the jacob edwards library again free of charge I also wanted to mention to all my friends is your mask. Please wear your mask in the library. Sanitize and wear your mask. Keep social distance just like in school. We want to keep everyone safe. So we just want to make sure that you know that you will be safe here in the library. We're all wearing our mask. You can wear your mask with us. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. some non-fiction books on animals. Oh, come with me. For our friends at Eastford Road. Oh, They're so come with me. All righty. We're going to go this way. All right. We'll take you right down here. Oh, oh look. We already have a friend here hey, looking at this. Miss Lander. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is my favorite place. Oh, I love the library. I'm looking at some really great looking books about some animals, the lions and tigers oh, and bears. Look how exciting. Oh my, I, oh my. I would like to take one home so I can read it. Should what I just a great idea. All right, I'm gonna pick I'll up. meet you at the desk. All right, I'll be right there. I'm gonna go check my book out now. Right. This Liz, I found one on um, polar bears, and then we're studying inventions at Eastford Road School, so I found one on inventions, oh, too. Oh, that's awesome. Two I have my cards. Books. Oh, library card is very important. Remember, bring it in, and if you have any problems or anything, or you think you lost it, don't worry. Just come see Miss Liz or anyone on the staff at the Jacob Edwards, and we will help you with your card. Thank you. Go. To do three weeks from today. Okay. Oh, Miss Liz, before I go, I had some questions. I got my summer reading list from Eastford Road, and they had oh. Tales and Tales books on there, but I don't know how to find out about the shows that you were talking about and where I find information on how to sign up or what am I supposed to do. Perfect. So I can help you there. So we have information right here. We have our flyers for the month, and it tells you all the dates and times for all our programs. So our summer reading our registration is Monday starts the week of Monday, June 21st. Okay. And that night we start out with a wizard. Oh, okay. And so you can register all week. And then the following week is when it officially starts and we will have another program again on a Monday night and it would be a magician. And it just goes forward so every month there will be a flyer and then Miss Liz has also made up a whole spreadsheet, uh, a flyer of all summer long, all our programs on Monday nights, all broken down for you. And as far as selecting your Tales and Tales books from your summer reading list, we have those all here in a special section in the room. Great. So I'll take you right to that right now. All right, and if I want to sign up, can I call on the phone or what should I do? Absolutely. You can call on the phone okay. or do it in person. Oh, okay. And there will be a little prize for the first 50 people who oh, sign up. I like so prizes, yes. Can I be go one of the first 50. And can I go see those books now? Because I would sure. love to see them. So here is where our summer books are, Miss Stella. And there's some true, uh, a wide selection of fiction and nonfiction titles on tales and tails.
Okay, I see two of my favorites already. So. Oh, and one of those. Chalk and Wordy Bird, those oh, are really great books. Those are really yeah. good books. Well, thank you for showing me. All right, thanks. Thanks so much, Ms. Liz. You answered all my questions about summer reading in the library. I'm so excited. Oh, I you're welcome, Miss Stella. Oh, Ms. Ladner, did you hear about all the fun things they're doing this summer? I, I'm so excited. I am so excited, too. I can't wait, and you never know who you're going to run into at the Jacob Edwards right. Library. We hope to see you this summer, friends. Yes, Bye, definitely. Friends. Bye, friends. Can't wait to hear all about your reading in the fall.